Petunia Natural Park is an MGM cartoon from 1939. This is actually a Captain and the Kids cartoon, and it's not too bad. It didn't really feel like any of the Captain and the Kids cartoons that I've seen. I've seen a, a good handful, but I still have a lot to go. So I don't know if this is typical of a lot of the others or if this one's a little bit different, but either way, I rather enjoyed it. This one's directed by Fritz Freelang and written by Alan Freelang and Joseph Barbera. And we have a voice cast, including Mel Blanc, Billy Bletcher, Melvin J. Gibby, Alan Ladd, Danny Webb and Martha Wentworth and the captain and his family go to Petunia Natural Park and it's all about uh, well a series of gags of them interacting with the animals and nature and I rather enjoyed it a lot. It's not the most unique concept, there are many cartoons around this time of both visual gags and also um, comedy in the narration. This one is narrated by uh, Alan Ladd, and I think the narration is absolutely fantastic. I really thoroughly enjoyed listening to it. My favourite gag in this, I won't spoil it, but it's the one with the babbling brooks. I mean, to be honest, that's basically the joke, but I won't give it all away. But there are a lot of little things. It, it, it goes from one joke to the next really, really quickly. The pacing is absolutely fantastic. It packs a lot into a really short space of time. It's very, very well animated. There's a lot to look at. Visually, it is really gorgeous. The colour palette it's beautiful. We have a lot of, understandably, a lot of very earthy tones and browns and greens, and it's definitely very atmospheric. So I, I had a lot of fun with it. It might not be that unique in terms of the concept. It is, for me, a little bit different compared to the other Captain and the Kids cartoons that I've seen. But as I've said, I do still have a few more to see, so this could be quite typical for some of the others. But either way, I rather enjoyed it. It's a decent concept. It works very well. We have a nice amount of jokes in this. So if one doesn't appeal to you, chances are the next one will. The animation is absolutely brilliant. And it's definitely worth checking out. Whether you've seen any Captain and the Kids before or this will be your first one, I'd say it's one that's worth checking out. I doubt I'd ever watch it a second time, mostly just because there's nothing about it that's that's unique or hilariously funny, but all that being said, it worked well, I did enjoy it, and I do recommend it.